Oftentimes, Red Robinson and I have sat around your living room looking at your scrapbook, scrapbook, and I, we're going to share that with you this afternoon. Uh, one of the things that, uh, one of the many firsts that Red has in the scrapbook is that you were the first guy to play Elvis Presley on the West Coast. That's right. Matter of fact, uh, at the time, I thought Elvis was uh, a country singer, and I had a terrific argument with the local RCA Victor promotion guy, and I said, I'm not going to play it because he's a country singer. He said, play it and I'll answer the phones. And so we played Elvis's record, and matter of fact, I sent a telegram to the factory back uh, in Toronto because overnight he, of course, became a, an instant success. And you emceed the first Elvis Presley show in town here. Well, right? it's the only one, of course, the only tour he ever took and uh, was in Vancouver late August, August about the 22nd, 1957. And uh, did, I think, Ottawa and Toronto, a couple areas in Canada and, of course, all of the United States. He's quite a guy. He's just a, you know, a down-to-earth uh, person, just like anyone you'd meet anywhere. He's not an intellectual guy by any stretch of the imagination, but a nice person, I thought. That may be a saving grace for Elvis, not being an intellectual. Right, he was, he, was in town, through it all. he was in town many hours, and uh, I, I got to know him as well as you can, an entertainer, and he was a very nice guy.